بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم لا حول ولا قوة إلا بالله العلي العظيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد وآل الطيبين الطاهرين بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم إنا أنزلناه في ليلة القدر وما أدراك ما ليلة القدر ليلة القدر خير من ألف شهر تنزل الملائكة والروح فيها بإذن ربهم من كل أمر سلام هي حتى مطبع الفجر ليلة القدر is a very special night not only it is better than any other night in the year it is better than any other night even in the month of Ramadan which is a special which is the month of Allah so Laylatul Qad is the best night also in the month of Ramadan the night which Allah says it is Mubarakah it's very blessed the night which Allah says Salamun hiya hatta matla night of peace the night that Allah says to the Prophet Wama adraka ma laylatul what made you understand what is Laylatul Qadr the night that Allah says khairun min alf shahr is better than 1000 month the night in which the Quran as a whole was revealed to the Prophet the night in which every year tanazzalul malaikatu wal ruhu fiha bi'izn rabbihim min kull amr all the angels and spirit bring affairs of inhabitants of earth down to the hujja of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so it's a very special night and as Imam Baghir salam said in a hadith that we find in Al-Kafi Man la yahdhuru al in response to question of Hamran about what does it mean that this night is better than 1000 months Imam said it means that if you do any good thing any righteous deed in this month is like doing it for 1000 months if you manage to do two rakah prayer in the night of Qad is like doing two rakah prayer today tomorrow up to the end of the month then the next month up to 1000 months if you give sadaqa if you give five pounds sadaqa in the layla to in the night of Qad is like giving five pounds sadaqa every night for 30,000 nights even Quran says better khayrun min alf shah so we have a unique opportunity we have a golden opportunity and we should not miss it some ulama throughout the year they prepare themselves for Laylatul Qadr the late Ayatollah Sheikh Muhammad Hussein Isfahani Arabi teacher of people like Ayatollah Khui Rahmatullah Alay used to recite every day 1000 Enna Anzalna Fi Laylatul Qadr 1000 times Surat Qadr Many people throughout the year think of Laylatul Qadr in the Salat say Laylatul Surat Qadr because as soon as we finish Laylatul Qad, we have to start preparing for the next Laylatul Qad. These are our great opportunities. Imam Baqir alayhi salam says in the same hadith, the reason Allah so much multiplies the reward for believers is that they need provision. And if the reward is not multiplied, Imam says, Ma balagu, they will not be able to reach their destination so we need to make the most out of Laylatul Qadr but before we enter Laylatul Qadr not only we should make Qusl in the beginning of Laylatul Qadr to wash and clean our body and also get a spiritual benefit of Qusl and evolution but also we should wash our heart any hatred any enmity any mistrust any suspicion any problem we have with people we should try to clean and wash our heart we should forgive each other as we expect Allah to forgive us instead we should have in our heart good will good intention good desire for people we should pray for them we should pray for uh, people who have rights upon us in particular and we should ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for forgiveness. We should make sincere tawbah and commit ourselves 
not to repeat our sins and to fix the damage which we have caused to ourselves and others as much as possible. So with preparation, with dua, with sadaqah, with asking your parents to pray for you, asking other people to pray for you, inshallah you would be ready to enter Laylatul Qadr. I hope you would have great night of Qadr this year and inshallah would have great year following that. Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen.